I told myself I wouldn't simp today. Prepare yourself, Dan Saiyan. Smash that like button and if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications that way you never miss a video. Today I have a brand new Dragon Ball fan manga from Terra Nova, the creator of Jiren X Android 21. So for those of you guys who really enjoyed those videos, I would say support her on her Patreon. I'm going to leave a link to her Patreon in the description below and the top comment. That way you guys can go ahead, give her some love, and that way she can put out this content a lot faster and a lot easier. But today I am going to go all the way back to the origin of Jiren. Now, some of you guys may be having deja vu don't you worry this is not the exact same story that you may be thinking it was about a month ago no we actually have a lot more pages in here and we have a fuller fleshed out story for jiren and his origin something that we really didn't see in dragon ball super another failure of dragon ball super to give such an interesting character at least at the time an interesting character like jiren basically a bare bones story that was exactly like Sa and it hurt. So let's jump right in. We begin our story in universe 11 and we go into a clearing where we see Jiren with his father and his father is there to teach him a brand new technique and this is a technique that Jiren will be known for in the tournament of power. It is a key hold and a key explode. He used this on several characters in the Tournament of Power and we find out here that Jiren's father is the one that showed him this. Jiren has to focus his inner key, take aim at the rock, and when he releases it, the rock explodes and Jiren's father is immensely proud of him because he is well beyond what Jiren's father was at that age. Now Jiren is excited to not only spend time with his father, but also blow up more shit. So he wants to blow up this bigger rock, but his father says, I actually have some errands to run for your mother in a nearby village, so we don't have time for that. But maybe when I get back, I will give you some flying lessons. And Jiren cannot wait to fly, and his father puts him on his shoulder and says, Someday soon, if you just keep on training and training and practicing and practicing, you will be a lot stronger, and one day you may even surpass me and I'm getting like heavy Lion King vibes right now Mufasa Simba and we already kind of know that this is how it plays out because Jiren's family and his village doesn't make it into the future of universe 11 just then Jiren gets a Skype call and it is his wife telling him that the goods are ready for transport and he tells his son that I was just talking to your mother it is time for us to head back to the village and this plays into the fact that the Jiren race has these really strong telepathic abilities that not every other race has besides the freezer race so I definitely like this this is a perfectly convenient way to use the Dragon Ball powers in an everyday situation. Jiren stays behind to play by the river and Jiren's father decides to let him play and goes back to the village alone. Now we see an entire community of Jiren's people and even a Jiren dog which um, looks kind of like a Vaporeon but still pretty cute and he lands to find them gearing up and preparing for a feast and Jiren's father uses the power of blowing shit up and instead cooks Big Bird in a flash so that way the food will be ready faster and that is when his wife comes out to meet him and uh she be thick boys she be thick and that is where this story ends right now. That's what I'm telling you guys. Go support Tierra Nova on Patreon, on Twitter. It looks like we're heading toward the massacre of Jiren's family and village by this unknown stranger, this, this evil being, because Jiren's not there, obviously. So, yeah, they're probably going to get massacred here soon, which is pretty sad, but at least we got to see some of Jiren's character development, and that is what we did not get to see in Dragon Ball Super. Anyway, if you made it to this point in the video, you're now part of the hashtag end of video squad. Thank you guys so much for all your support. Make sure you drop that comment with that hashtag for a chance to be featured in my next video. Today, I'm responding to God Goku. Nope, Majin Bra is going to have the fused body because of her stronger personality and we're talking about a fusion between bra and bra essentially good and evil and yes probably more the characteristics are going to be the evil bra but there's still going to be that good in there that may not kill everybody in the entire stadium who knows anyway thank you so much for your comment this is going to be blackscape signing off take care guys
subscribe for more content. Yeah.